Whether you rent or buy, you're paying a mortgage. Believe it or not, there are still some people out there that haven't purchased a home yet because they're afraid of taking on a mortgage. Well, everyone should realize, unless they're living at their parents' house rent-free, they are paying a mortgage. They're either paying their own mortgage or their landlord's mortgage, as the Joint Centers for Housing Studies at Harvard University explains. Households must consume housing whether they own or rent. Not even accounting for more favorable tax treatment of owning, homeowners pay debt service to pay down their own principal while households that pay rent pay down the principal of a landlord plus a rate of return. That's yet another reason owning often does, as Americans into it, end up making more financial sense than renting. Now, if that statement from Harvard University wasn't enough to articulate the difference between paying rent and paying a mortgage, well, here's what Christina Boyle, a senior vice president at Freddie Mac, had to say. With a 30-year fixed rate mortgage, you'll have the certainty and stability of knowing what your mortgage payment will be for the next 30 years, unlike rents which continue to rise over the next three decades. Now, I know I've talked about this topic many times before, and I'll link one of my videos right here, but home ownership is a form of forced savings. If you're paying your rent on time, I think that's great, but you are paying your landlord's mortgage, and you're also causing your landlord to get richer. Why not make yourself richer? Interest rates are still at historic lows, making it one of the best times to secure a mortgage and make that move into your dream home. Freddie Mac's latest report shows that interest rates were at 3.43% last week. Here's a quick market update from Merrill Lynch. The Merrill Lynch mid-year update, the re-emergence of the emerging markets video on their YouTube page highlighted many variables and factors that they believe will keep interest rates low for a period of time. Here's the bottom line. Whether you're looking for that first home or vacation home, now may be a great time to buy. Hey, if you found this video useful, don't forget to tell me all about it down below in the comment section and share it with your friends. Also, if you love the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe down below. I love helping people with their real estate needs and sharing information with you on a regular basis. I'll see you next time.